It happened this week, the passing of a gay rights pioneer. Franklin Kameny died this past Tuesday at the age of 86. A World War II veteran, Kameny took a civilian job with the Army Map Service in 1956, only to be fired within a year after his sexual orientation was exposed. Kameny became a leading gay rights activist, taking part, among other things, in a 1960s State Department protest that much annoyed the then Secretary of State, Dean Rusk. Well, I understand that we're being picketed by a group uh, of homosexuals. Uh, the uh, policy of the department is that we do not employ homosexuals knowingly, and that if we discover homosexuals in our department, we discharge them. The position Franklin Kameny rebutted in the strongest terms. Every American citizen has the right to be considered by his government on the basis of his own personal merits as an individual. Certainly some homosexuals are poor risks. This is no possible excuse for penalizing all homosexuals. The federal government eventually ended its hiring ban. And when President Obama signed an order expanding gay partnership benefits for federal workers two years ago, Franklin Kameny was there. As for his proudest accomplishment, Kameny told talk show host Mark Levine last year it was a certain slogan he came up with. I settled on gay is good, and if after I'm gone, I, re I am remembered for absolutely nothing else, I want to be remembered for having coined that slogan, gay is good. Franklin Kameny will be remembered for that, all right. And much, much more.